Hello and welcome back to the Forgotten City. Today we will do fourth ending again, but this time we make sure everything goes right. Uh, I need to get uh, okay. Uh, give that to Lucretia. Uh, give that to Rufius. Uh, stop Fabia right. entering shrine. Tell uh, Maliolus, you know his real name is Quinctus. Thanks to Claudia, and that never sends his regards. Then tell him to withdraw from the election and release his dead bondsman. What? Are you? You're serious, yep. aren't you? I doubt Demetrius will let me talk to him, but I'll make sure he passes on the message. Thank you. That's it. Now go. As fast as you can. But once I'm done, I'll need you to tell me how you know all of this. And now I'm gonna save. Just in case uh, I'll somehow make it faster to the temple. And he does all, all of his errands. And after we are done with... Pluto, Hades, Osiris, uh, Nergo. We will talk with all those who we saved. And I mean, we'll talk to we'll talk to Ulpius, to Julia, to Fabia, and those who are directly connected. So there's that. I wonder whether we should. Maybe I should put Gallius. Uh, I should nominate him, I think. I don't know if that changes anything. Because otherwise, the Sentis will be real like. Yep, I'll talk to Equitia first. Nominate. Please. Wait, why are you here? Salve, friend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think she should be in her. You're here? Why are you here? Not a good time, friend. Okay. Yeah, okay. Ave. Okay, I'll wait a bit. Okay, I'll save it right here. Ave. One. The other thing is done. The assassin. I think he gave the medicine. <laughs> Both medicines. Ah! Ave. Yes, yes, Quisha, Ave, Ave. Yeah, he's with the roof is now. Oh my goodness. I love door physics in this game. I don't know why, it's just so nice. Oh, I want to hear that. Oh no, he's going in. Or he's waiting. We've never gotten the key for these doors that are somewhere over there. Okay, that should do it. 
That's quite an impressive bow you have there. Really? He's not done yet. I just want to make sure everything goes perfectly, which means putting him as a candidate. Ave. Yes, go pay her a visit. That's quite an impressive bow you have there. Just like Diana's. Yes, I know. He is done. Give it all the Unless he didn't give Yulia her medicine. Nope, we're not done yet. Uh, come on, please, 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 please. Isn't please. the great temple majestic? I just noticed that your hand clips through your clothes, but. Okay. So I have to wait for that to do go through. Yeah, she's busy. Priestess, Maliolus has decided to withdraw from the election. Oh, well, that's surprising. But thank you for telling me. I'll let everyone know. Citizens, I have an announcement. Maliolus has withdrawn his candidacy from today's election. Unless any new challengers are nominated by nightfall, Sentius will be re-elected magistrate by default. And I won't allow that. I'd, uh, okay, uh, that's great. I'd like to nominate myself. Citizen. So we can go to the temple straight away. I didn't have to wait for all that to happen. God damn it. At least we know for sure this is what happened. Okay, I <laughs> I wasn't sure. I had to check it. Where are you going? Sorry, was there something you wanted? Okay, never mind. Is there still that one door we haven't opened? I thought she was going to get in there. Okay, never mind. Last safe. And we're in. The last talk. The last talk with Pluto. He'll get mad again. And there's only one and the first and second ending we have to attend to Pluto. Okay, Hades. Oh, Zeris. And 
the Nargo. Hi, hello, yep. Yep, 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 yep. This post minus crown, I took it from her. I want to kill her, but if you put, don't put an end, that's... Well, what's it going to be? We just won't return to the world. Hmm. I will have Carol make it. Why? Once this exodus begins, the event what will be now? I'm ready. You would best. I'll just click through all the remaining dialogues. Because we've been through them multiple times. Especially with Kairon and with Al. Oh. Uh, hi. Well, yep, I can. I'm in no, now. Apparently, they will then an or saving prevent for <laughs> for and, and the exactly. Uh, that sounds a bit for fetch. I'm right behind you. <laughs> He's gonna stay behind and fix these doors so no one ever falls in there again. Okay. Right. So I think we were able to save everyone. You're back. Yep. But ah, I found him. Oh, why don't you? Ah, I see. I thought you might. Well, now you know. I suppose you have questions. You can just call. Me. I do that. Yes, this is my Or Would I die? I suppose oh. not. What's a special business? Coins? Why? I see no point in keeping you here. But I have to ask one thing. That you keep this to yourself. Look! Here comes Al now! Al! It's so good to see you! You were gone so long I thought I'd never see you again! Kinda lost track of time in there. You wouldn't believe what we found. The ruins of a long-forgotten city. And there was a tablet describing an oracle who confronted a god and undid an ancient curse. Sounds like quite a story. And I look forward to hearing all about it. But, you two look exhausted. Why don't you hop in my boat and rest while I ferry you back to civilization? Sounds good to me. And you? Are you ready to go home? Alright. Yep, 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 we've been for that. Thank you. Now who? Oh, we have to talk to you. Right. No, you are. You're finally here. Remember me? Being Galliers. It's a crazy story. After you disappeared, Karen appeared and told yes. us. Yes. Even gave us some coins to help us. Anyway, I know we only ever had that one conversation, and I, I wanted to say, thanks. If... I know. I can't believe my luck either. We're planning okay. to get that. Okay. Of course. Now let's see those oh, we've, we've missed earlier. Like, Yulia! Hi there. You're here. 
It's so good to see you again. How are you? I'm alright. I wanted to come here and thank you again for saving my life. And of course, getting me and all of us out of a terrible situation. What are you doing for all these days? Oh, I barely recognize myself. I'm living in a house share in London with my wonderful girlfriend. And I'm studying English at university. Eventually, I want to travel the world and write about it. Turns out, it's about 30 times bigger than the Roman Empire ever was. Did you know there are entire continents Rome never knew existed? And you can travel almost anywhere in an aircraft, which is rather like flying on a Pegasus, but much more comfortable. Oh, sorry, you already know all that, of course. I'm just so excited. There's so much to see and learn and write about. Seeing it all through fresh eyes sounds wonderful. I have noticed people from your time have no idea how fortunate they are. I hope to change that. One day. Whatever happened to Malios and Claudia? Last I heard, Maliolus kept insisting he was the last rightful ruler of the Roman Empire and wound up being committed to a psychiatric hospital. Oh, that's what happened. As for Claudia, she was always so viciously unhappy. Someone said she'd blown all her money on wine, trying to drink herself back to the underworld. After the horrific way they treated Ulpius and me, I can't help feeling a sense of... What's that German word? Schadenfreude? I think you're allowed to feel that way. Thank you. You're very kind. What ever happened to Aurelia? Ugh. Someone told me she was boasting about getting her claws into some rich prince. And how she was going to be living the high life from now on. Even in your time, life still isn't fair. Apparently, he'd proposed before they'd even met. And last I heard, she'd bought herself a first-class one-way ticket to join him in some exotic place called... What was it? Nigeria? Some people have all the luck. Don't worry, something tells me she's going to get what she deserves. No, I, as the Oracle, I foresee terrible disappointment in her future. Really? Huh. Yep. I feel better already. Thank you. It was good to see you again. You too. If you're ever in London, let me know. We can go to bars and drink wine and listen to the stories of the nine million people who live there. I'll take you up on that. I hope so. Fabia! You're... the one we've been waiting for. I'm Fabia. Hi. I wanted to say thanks for sending Galerius to save my life. I don't know how you knew, but I would have been crushed by that shrine for sure. You're welcome. I'm just so happy to be here, with you and everyone, together again. Even if it's just for one more night. What are you doing for yourself these days? Well, it's not like I have to work with all the silver Karen gave me, so I just do what makes me happy. Mostly that means baking for my friends and looking at memes while binging TV shows in yoga pants. <laughs> what a time to be alive. I'm glad you're happy. Thank you. I really am. It was good to see you. You too. Now, uh, who else is there? Met with you. Good evening. Good evening. Rufius. Nice to meet you. Good to see you too. I go by Rufus now. New start, new name. Oh, and uh, thanks, by the way, for what you did. Sorry, I'm no good with the mushy stuff. What are you doing yourself these days? I live with Virgil in Rotterdam, not far from where he grew up. It's very modern. Destroyed in the war and it rebuilt itself. Good place for a fresh start. I haven't decided what I'm going to do with my life yet. Hmm. One adjustment at a time. It turns out you're right. The statues were really were watching us. Huh. Good to know. Anyway, it was good practice for the new world. Security cameras and smartphones everywhere. 
have to stay vigilant. That is unfortunately true. Mm. It was good to see you again. You too. Look us up next time you're in the Netherlands. I'm... We're grateful. Hello there. Hi. Oh, I go by Gabriella now. I didn't want to be reminded of that monster every time I heard my own name. After you drove Pluto off, Proserpina came and released me. And that monster got what was coming to him. It sounds like he got what he deserved. Mm -hmm. What are you doing with yourself these days? I'm living with Ulpius on a little vineyard in Umbria. It's even more wonderful than I dreamed it would be. I'm so grateful to you for making sure he's still with us. If you're ever passing through the region, I hope you'll come and visit us. You can try some of our very own wine. I might just do that. It was good to see you Thanks. again. You too. It's nice to finally put a face to the name. I'm Opius. Good to see you too, Opius. I understand I have you to thank for sending Galerius to save my life. The way you just showed up out of the blue and stopped me from making a terrible mistake. I'll be forever in your debt. What are you doing with yourself these days? I'm living with Gabriella in Umbria. We finally bought the little vineyard we always dreamed of. It'll be a little while before we know what we're doing, but every day I look at her and this extraordinary new world with all its beauty and I think, what if I'd given up hope and missed out on all of this? So we're living each day to the fullest. And we end them all the same way, sitting together on our terrace with a glass of our wine, which the locals say is almost drinkable now, and watching the sun set over the rolling hillside. And I couldn't be happier. I'm glad you're happy. Thank you. I wouldn't be here without you. It was good to see you. You too. And that's all of them. Alive. That's probably gonna be the same conversation. There you are. Now there's mm. one. <laughs> Sorry if I frightened you. I recognize Hello, that voice. I am Persephone. I want. Yep. It was nice. We've been for all of that. And you. Oh, and one last thing. Oh, of course. Good. Because they remember you. Well done, my and friend. And that is gonna be it for today. There are still two more endings left. So for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!